Welcome to Eurochem TV, where we discuss and demonstrate all things Eurochem. Today's topic is the proper use and application of Eurochem's MS Performance Clear UC410. UC410 Performance Clear is our entry level medium solids clear that provides high gloss, depth of image, and good outdoor durability. UC410 cuts and buffs easily after 24 hours cure and can be cut and buffed indefinitely. UC410 is not compliant for use in low VOC markets, such as most of California, Maryland, and Delaware. So always check your local regulations before purchasing. We do offer a low VOC clear coat compliant in markets that require low VOC finishes. As with any automotive finish, proper painting conditions are important for obtaining the best results. It's best to paint in temperatures above 60 degrees Fahrenheit part temperature and at least 70 degrees Fahrenheit paint material temperature. Keep in mind that the conditions outside are brought into your booth through your booth intake. Moisture should be a concern when applying automotive finishes, so unless your paint booth has the ability to heat your parts well above the dew point, you should not paint when raining, dew on the ground, or fog in the air. Parts painted at temperatures near the dew point can easily condensate thin layers of moisture which are often not visible on the part or in the paint film itself but can cause failure to the finish. Low humidity blue sky days are the best conditions for painting provided you can get your part temperatures above 60 degrees Fahrenheit. Once you have your parts ready to paint and the conditions are good for painting, start by wearing the appropriate personal protective equipment and only use this product in areas that are free of ignition sources such as heat, sparks, or open flames. There is no need to shake this clear coat prior to opening. In fact, shaking the can of clear can cause micro foam that can end up in your finished product. UC410 mixes 4 to 1 by volume with Eurochem's UA series activators. Measuring and mixing is made easy using the 4 to 1 column on the Eurochem mixing cup. Mix gently, then strain into your spray gun. For best atomization, spray pressures should be set to 20 to 26 psi at the trigger for gravity fed HVLP guns or 40 to 55 psi for siphon fed guns. For reduced pressure guns, refer to the manufacturer's recommendations for a good starting point. Guns equipped with 1.3 or 1.4 millimeter fluid tips are considered optimal, but smaller or larger tips may work satisfactory depending on the gun. One often forgotten setting is your fluid or trigger adjustment. The knob behind the trigger on your spray gun is what controls how much fluid is released to the spray head. Too much material released results in large droplets and too much material applied and too little material results in smaller droplets which can lead to dry spray. Each time you use your spray gun, it's a good practice to screw the fluid adjustment clockwise all the way to hand tight, then count the rotations as you turn it counterclockwise to open it up. With UC410, three to four turns out from hand tight is generally a good starting point. At this point, you're ready to do a test spray on paper or on your booth wall. Your spray pattern should be a tight and uniform ellipse. If not, then you may need to clean some of the small orifices in your spray tip or air cap. Once you have a good spray pattern, it's a good idea to spray a test panel to make sure the product flows well and you're happy with your settings. Apply three wet coats with 50 to 75% overlap, allowing 15 minutes flash times between coats. A 6 to 8 inch fan pattern at approximately a 6 inch gun distance is a good general rule. After your last coat, clean your gun immediately with a gun cleaning solvent, lacquer thinner, acetone, or MEK. Check local regulations for compliant gun cleaner options. UC410 should be allowed to cure at least 24 hours before wet sanding and polishing if desired. Thanks for joining us on the proper use of Eurochem's MS Performance Clear UC410. This product and many more available online at www.thecoatingstore.com. Be sure to like and subscribe to our channel, Eurochem TV, so you don't miss other great videos. Thanks for watching.